Hello, incoming cohort. My name is Emily and I am an education volunteer here in Peace Corps, Jamaica. So today we're going to talk to the education volunteers specifically about what is appropriate to wear to school here in Jamaica. So in this video, um, you're going to learn a little bit more what the teachers at the school actually wear. Um, I have filmed some of the teachers at my school to let you guys see what your actual co-workers will be wearing and then also what some of the volunteers have been able to wear. I am Dawn Graham and I'm the principal for primary school. On any given day we are expected to dress um, professionally. Jamaican standard professionally means you would be wearing a, uh, if it's a dress then it can't be sleeveless, it has to have even, you know, little sleeve as I'm wearing now. Usually teachers are in their jacket with an inside piece, skirt, and pants. Some persons will wear blazers, um, stocking. Some people do their stocking. Um, I'm wearing a low pair of shoes today, but teachers at times will wear something with more heels. For the Peace Corps volunteers, however, um, who are not usually accustomed to our climate, the heat will dictate that you try to wear as limited amount of clothing as possible while being as professional as possible. Hey, my name is Norman Nicholas, a teacher. And uh, welcome to Jamaica, even though you're not here as yet. In Jamaica, we really care not much for dress, but we do like to look a little on the sharp side. And therefore, you'll see a tie and a dress shirt, uh, a formal attire. You may not wear the tie if you're not very comfortable, but that's alright. Bow tie or the long elongated one is fine. Your gentleman's shoe where you will wear something that's comfortable. Uh, not all of us have the lovely toes to bow stuff, so we don't wear sandals or slippers to have our toes hanging. So we wear a dress shoe and uh, pants to go along with that. Have fun. Hi, my name is Sharon Martin Touch. I work alongside the principal and in the lab, and this is what I wear to school. Hi, my name is Mohammed. I'm an education volunteer in Jamaica. This is what I wear to school. So a shirt, khaki pants, and dress shoes. And you know, you gotta keep it fresh and professional. Hi, I'm Erin McCoy from Group 89, education volunteer, and this is what I wear to school. I like to wear my loose kimono over tank top dresses because it has a pop of color, but then it also still keeps me cool in the hot Jamaican weather. And then I also wear my flats. I got these from Tom's. Have a great day. So as you can see, um, I have on something that has like longer sleeves, but I push them up. Um, I have a dress that keeps me pretty cool that falls just above my knees. Um, and then I also am wearing flats. Um, they're work shoes. These are Crocs. Um, and I have been able to wear them for a full two years. They don't smell great at this point, but what I do is I put vinegar in them or bleach and I wash them out almost every night so that they smell a little bit better. But I have found that any other flats that I have brought here that are not the Crocs, that aren't these rubber brand, um, they just, they fall apart within a week or two. So I highly recommend them. I've been wearing them constantly for two years. 
when I first got here, I wore pants all the time. I would wear long black pants and like a button down tucked in. Um, but I found that it took too much ironing and upkeep to do it that way. And I was way too hot. It is so, so hot here. So I highly recommend um, wearing something that you're comfortable in. If pants is what you're comfortable in, um, just kind of be aware of maybe buying some shirts that you don't have to iron constantly um, or materials that are kind of like this that don't get wrinkly.